it's time for me to get married. Settle down. What do you think? Yeah, yeah. Carol's looking for a husband. Yes, I am. So, any eligible bachelors that can cook, there's your woman right there. I make them smear from the, from the what, what do they call them? The onions. <laughs> <laughs> You're not onioned. Well, what did we buy? Shallots. Shallots. Oh, God, I had a nice makeup job with all ruined, but that's okay. We're just here in Tennessee's house in Los Angeles. Really Los Angeles, downtown. And later, we're going to show you the view, and we're going to vector in some UFOs. A technique I learned from a doctor friend of mine, who's a ufologist, the biggest in the world, and I happen to follow him. Yeah. And I want Tennessee to see what I see. And the final step, we have some frozen peas. We're going to add it into the sauce. In two minutes, it's going to cook. That's all it'll take. Oh, and the sauce is already thickening. Look, Tennessee. God, that looks good. Do I need any more peas now? It's just really a cornish. We're going to have corn on cob. Which we had, what did we have for the vegetable with our veal scallopini that night? Do you remember? Mm -hmm. Uh, asparagus. Grilled asparagus. Yum, yum. But today we decided, you know, and we were right by the asparagus, but we decided to go with corn on the cob because it's summertime. Yeah. And here we have it. We have our filet scallopini. Came out lovely. The sauce was reduced. I think it's going to be great. Tennessee, thanks for having me in your home. I really enjoyed it. And happy summer. Summer's not over till my birthday, September 23rd. So, bye everybody. Enjoy the rest of your summer. Well, hey everybody. So we had a lovely dinner. I made a little show out of it. Um, it's September 1st. It's 2.30 in the morning, which is the perfect time to do what we're about to do. Do you know what we're going to do, Tennessee? Uh, I think it's something about capturing a UFO on film. Correct. That's our goal. Now, how do we do that? Well, we're going to turn around and we're going to visualize ourselves going up in the air into outer space, looking down on Los Angeles. This is Tennessee's beautiful view of downtown Los Angeles. And right over here is a corridor where the planes fly. Now, why is it a perfect time? Because all the planes are in LAX. There's no more planes. This corridor is empty now. So, what we see, hopefully, what we vector in with our minds is going to be real UFOs or glowing orbs or some sort of something. And how we do it is, as we rise, we see Los Angeles, we see the apartment building, we go up, 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 we go into the Milky Way, and we invite with our minds for the, for the extraterrestrials to come and show us because they come in peace. And that's all you need to do. You have to show them where you are and that you want to be open and peaceful. And hopefully they, they help us through telepathy. All right, so we're going to begin. So we're going to turn around. Whee! Turn around. That's a Tennessee. And now, basically, we're going to imagine ourselves going up into the sky, over Los Angeles, see the United States. Oh my God. We're here. We want to raise our minds up into the galaxy. So we're going up, up, up. We're looking down on the apartment. Looking down on the apartment, just to close the eyes. As we're going up, we see Los Angeles. We see the apartment. We go up, up, up through the clouds. It's a beautiful night, September 1st, 2013. Up, up, up. We see the United States from space. Can you see it? Yeah. We see the whole map of the United States. We go up, up. We start to see the roundness of the Earth. It's getting darker. We see the lights going up, up, up. Now we're in space and we're in the Milky Way. And we're just traveling our souls, our bodies back in Los Angeles. 
And we're just zooming around, looking at the planets. And we offer, we offer ourselves up to anyone who'd like to assist us in our journey. So we tell them where we are in Los Angeles. We look down. We look down. We can see the United States. We're going down. We see California. Down. We see the lights. We see Los Angeles. And we see your apartment building in Tennessee. Now we're on the balcony. And we offer up ourselves would like a visitation to help us on our quest. You show them right where we are, right on your balcony. Bring us knowledge, wisdom, serenity. The millions of years ahead of us We need the help to ease our troubles, to give us the next great idea. Always with the thought of helping mankind. Right here. Right here. Any lights yet, Tennessee? Not a one. Come. Come in peace. See that star before. But I've had UFOs come here in light right here, and their door pop open, and they get out. And then they get back on, and they get, then they go down there to Disneyland. Mm -hmm. And they're peaceful, right? Yeah, it's very fast. How it's the uh, cartoon world is the UFO world, big way in a big way. That's the reason they, get, they head down to Disneyland. And the, we just had a huge started talking. That star came up a little bit, and then there were some lights 
they shot into it. You know, they they came in here and they shot on both sides, they and then they kind of clustered around it. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. you know, so. That gives them into where you are. Right. All right, that was a pretty good experiment. Yeah, it's pretty good, and um, I had a nice evening. let's see, have a nice evening from the UFO Outlook here at the Pieces. California Plaza. Yeah.